position? Answer C is correct. The tube actually moves slightly upwards at first and then downwards and forwards in a shallow curve. The tube is shot forward and assumes the flight path of a stone against the headwind. It also executes a superimposed backward rotation. The drag between the tube and air and the headwind causes the air to flow past the tube, moving quickly at the top and slightly slower at the bottom. This creates upward suction and makes the whole tube initially move upwards before gliding to the floor in a gentle forward curve. This effect is called the Magnus effect. <laughs>